That was brilliant. I mean, these look like things that you threaten burglars with. Are they, or are they the, are they the, the real authentic instrument? No, they're not really authentic. The originals are in captivity in museums, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. So these are accurate copies. They're accurate copies? Mm -hmm. What was this music performed for in 58? I mean, how was it performed? The sort of stuff we do is the popular music of the time. Yeah. Uh, used for dancing and singing. Yeah. Jolly stuff. So, I mean, how would it... How would a band get famous in 1588? I mean, didn't have any videos or anything like that. So how would they do it? Well, every town of any size would have had a band such as this, and they'd have been quite well known in their location. Yeah. And those musicians, on the whole, took the lead from musicians in London, where yeah. there was a great gathering of continental musicians, quite well known people. So honestly, they'd have set the trend, as it were. Well, listen, guys. Honestly, it's been great having you here today. It's been nice to see you doing it with a sense of fun and not taking yourself too seriously. It's been great. You see, we've been talking about all aspects of performance, but now is the time for the performance to end all performances. Gary, are you ready? Yes! Mark, are you ready? Yes! You see, now is the time for the genuine, authentic WTN Raspberry Jam. Take it away, Alan Rogers. Yes.